Hello everyone. The tensors are having different kind of operations like addition, multiplication, which is including a dot product and Hada mode product. The third operation is important operation broadcasting, transpose and inverse. When you are performing arithmetic operation addition between two tensors, we have to perform element wise addition in the two tensors. Here we will take tensor A and tensor B, the result will be stored uh, in the tensor C. So here the C equal to tensor A and tensor B is added here. For addition of two tensors, the dimension of the tensor should be matched. For example, here tensor A is also having 2 by 2 uh, dimension and tensor B also having 2 by 2 dimension. Then addition here we are performing element wise 3 plus 0, uh, 3 then uh, element in the um, second position of the first tensor and second position of the second column of the uh, first row in the tensor B is added 2 plus 4, 6. Like that, uh, here the second row, second column of the first tensor, second row, second column of the second tensor is added 0 plus 0, 0. Then next one is multiplication. For multiplying the two tensors, we have to check the dimension of first matrix and second matrix. There, first matrix number of columns should be matched with the number of rows in the second matrix. So here we are checking that number of uh, columns in the first matrix and number of rows in the uh, second matrix. So both are matching then we can perform the multiplication between the two tensors then result is stored in the C. So here we are using the uh, result 6, 12, 0, 4. Here for each position we are performing the uh, sum of the products of that each and every rows and columns. Then next one is broadcasting is important approach in the tensor here when we are having uh, uh, two different uh, uh, objects like vectors and matrix if you are changing the tensors of different dimensions that means matrix will have uh, two dimension and the vector will have one dimension so when we want to perform arithmetic operations between uh, matrix and vectors we have to apply uh, the shape uh, changing manipulation of the shape of the vector or matrix for performing the arithmetic operations so this is done by broadcasting approach in the tensor so here which is a special type of uh, tensor addition operation where uh, the different kind of dimension uh, given in the form of matrix and a vector here the broadcasting is basically a programming approach for adding the matrix and a vector and here we can perform the mul uh, multiplication also between the matrix and vector the mathematical notation for the broadcasting is represented here the matrix and the vector is added and result is stored in the C uh, the dimension of the vector uh, should match either number of rows or number of columns here for example the matrix is considered as a tensor here which is having uh, 2 by 3 here, uh, dimension and the vector is B given here which is a uh, column vector uh, we are having a uh, 2 rows okay row 1 2 so here the number of rows are matching with the number of rows in the uh, column vector okay so here we are matching with number of rows so here uh, we can perform the uh, broadcasting operation if dimension is not matching then uh, here we cannot perform that uh, operation so here we are taking the uh, a plus b so in the a plus b so here we are uh, adding 1 plus 1 here and 3 plus 1 here and 5 plus 1 right then here second row here element wise operation second uh, row in the uh, first column of the vector and second row second column in the uh, tensor and second row second column in the uh, tensor b so this is 1d tensor this one is 2d tensor so we are performing the operation by using broadcasting approach then result is stored in the uh, tensor which is having the dimension 2 by 
3 and uh, there is hadamard product also can be done by using uh, tensors um, here element wise multiplication will be done the hadamard product is uh, represented by using the notation dot inside the circle tensor a tensor b here element wise multiplication is applying on two matrix uh, two tensors okay here we should not say matrix we have to call it is a tensor so 2 by 2 uh, here also 2 by 2 so we are performing the uh, element wise multiplication in the hadamard product 1 into 2 that is giving the first element in the tensor then second row uh, first uh, first row second column here 2 into 2 which is uh, 4 so like that we can perform the element wise multiplication in the hadamard tensor so this is the resultant uh, tensor for uh, multiplication of two tensors then dot product can be applied applied uh, between uh, two one dimensional tensors that means here uh, we are using the two one dimensional tensors here it is uh, represented in the form of a vector representation x vector here y vector so this is one dimensional uh, tensor this is another one dimensional tensor then we can apply the uh, dot product between them this so element wise multiplication 1 into 2 so that is giving this value then 2 into 3 which is giving this value finally you see dot product of one dimensional vector always will be a scalar value so that is the thing in matrix also which is giving you scalar value only okay so you see the uh, element wise multiplication which is giving you scalar, scalar value only but it, the structure is represented in the form of tensor uh, 2d tensor here which is representing in the form of scalar value so in tensor representation dot product can be written yes x transpose y this is x vector this is y vector so two tensors are there one dimensional tensors we can represent like this because uh, here we will perform the operation uh, like this so one two three four then here we will have another one uh, sorry another one uh, tensor here we will have like uh, uh, ka, ka, row vector okay so row, row vector will be given here uh, the second one two three one four so like this we will perform right then result will be uh, getting as a scalar that's what represented here a equal to x transpose this is x transpose this one is dot y suppose if you want to perform y transpose means it will become uh, two three one four okay right then you can perform the dot product with x that is the dot product uh, tensor wise uh, tensor uh, um, uh, element wise multiplication for the one dimensional tensor we can apply another operation transpose on the tensor for example i am having the tensor a yes i am having the tensor a with uh, 2 by 3 uh, dimension then i am applying the transpose to get the uh, change the or manipulating the given tensor into number of rows into number of columns number of columns will become as a number of rows so here this tensor after applying the transpose operation we are getting 3 by 2 dimension so here number of rows become as a number of sorry number of columns become as a number of rows number of rows in the given input uh, tensor become as a number of columns and another one operation is uh, tensor concurrent here which is process of combining uh, uh, more than two tensors uh, here uh, uh, we will use the axis to perform that uh, concatenation operation which is forming a large tensor this operation is commonly used to merge or combining the tensors in different dimensions here we are having uh, two tensors with the two by two uh, dimension then we are concatenating this along the axis zero here after concatenation we are getting the, uh, the uh, uh, tensor with uh, uh, four by two dimension so this is uh, another one operation in the tensor uh, operations uh, which is called tensor concatenation thanks for watching